Hey everybody, it's Sadie from Hip in Detroit. I am hanging outside the Loving Touch in Ferndale with George Morris. Say hello. Hello. Hi. Hi. Um, I saw you this year at the Blowout. Did you? Playing upstairs. To oh yeah. To web, correct? That was fun, yeah. Yes it was. But when I saw you the first time, was it just you and a piano? Yeah, it was just me and a piano and backing tracks, but not right. a full band. And now you have a full band, because yeah. I just watched you perform inside. Right. Cool. And so now we have guitar. Yeah, we've got, well, bass and drums. Mm -hmm. Elena, who's off camera, plays piano. And then I play some piano and guitar as well. Okay. So is the full band going to be the new permanent thing? Yes. Okay. So why did you make that change? Well, I missed playing in a band. And I wanted to, uh, the record's kind of mellow. It doesn't translate as much in the shows I wanted to play. It's fun to have a full band. The record's mellow. It is kind of mellow. Your live it. show is not mellow at yeah. all. No, I have not heard it. I would yeah, love to hear it. Yeah, it's all just... I've only heard the one song that you did on the W... What compilation was that? It had James Link on it. It had the Hounds Below. Oh yeah. It had the snake or something on the front. Yes, you have. I, I like the that. song. You played it again tonight. Cool. I, um, I should know that. You should. Well, know that's that. off the record. I'm sure. <laughs> it's uh, yeah. It was just kind of piano and organ and drum machine. And you wrote the whole thing yourself. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How many songs? Um, ten. Was there an inspiration to it? Well, originally, after the set pieces broke up, I wanted to be able to have a show that I could play anywhere by myself. Um, so I kind of decided the best way to do that was on piano with a drum machine. That would be the fullest thing instead of just touring around with an acoustic guitar because I didn't want to do that. Um, so I kind of decided to sit down and try and write some piano songs and organ songs. And they came pretty quickly and it was fun so I recorded it. How do you learn how to play organ? That's the same thing. Same thing as yeah. a piano? How'd you learn how to play piano? Um, well, I, I guess I, I already knew how to play guitar. It's, I think all kind of translate. Really? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That sounds like you're I'm, very I'm talented a, and he's being modest. I'm not modest. a good piano player by any means, I, but... Uh, you're a very good performer. Thanks. You definitely put on a show, you connect with the audience, you I look at to. the audience a lot. I like to, I try to. Yeah? I don't like to say much on stage. No. So... But I don't want to come across as a dick. You, know? <laughs> you didn't come across as a so dick I at like all. So I like to. How I would you describe the audience, your sound to somebody who's never heard you before? I don't know. That's a tough question. I know it's the worst question ever. Yeah. But I think somebody told me the best answer is to just to say other people, other bands that people like. Probably. Right? I mean, other bands that you like. Who are well, your I'm very inspirations? By the Beatles. I was always a star. Velvet Underground. Are you a uh, John or a Paul Beatles fan? Both. Both. I don't think, yeah, I don't have a, a line. That's a good answer. I yeah. agree with you on that. And I also like the Rolling Stones, too. I love the Rolling Stones. I grew Stones. up, growing up, I always thought I was only allowed to like one or the other. Yeah, that's definitely been. And then when I was like 18, I realized that's not true at all. And they're both awesome, completely different things. But, yeah, so you played with the Set and Peaches before this? Yeah. Uh, yeah that was and why did that come to an end? Well, we had some success early. Um, and we got a deal, and then never ended up, the record never really ended up coming out. Um, everybody who signed us ended up getting fired, oh, it's the same old story. <laughs> that's another, yeah, that's another story. Just didn't work out the way you wanted it But so. yeah, and then, so we kept going afterwards, uh, but we weren't playing the same shows we were playing, and we went from playing like 1,500 seat places over in the UK to the back to being nothing will be behind us. So we were trying to start from the bottom up again and it just got old. Do you like what you're doing more? Now I do, yeah. Um, that's the first time I've ever done anything under my own name. So that's kind of... That's really putting yourself out there. Nerve-wracking a yeah, little bit. Totally. Yeah, But it's exciting at the same time. And uh, I really like the band now. Yeah, it's I like that. I definitely, together. I loved you upstairs. I definitely enjoyed it. But that tonight, I thought it's you guys were amazing. Way, it was yeah. very full and sound. And I love all the people in it. And all, uh, you guys yeah, definitely play musicians. well together. I think I saw on one of the random online things today. Did you film a video? Yeah, we did. Tell um, me about it. Well, Jesse Shepherd Bates, um, we all know, right? Mm-hmm. Uh, came over to my house at 10 He's playing with the hand grenades he permanently now? He's playing with the hand grenades now, yeah. Okay. 
Uh -huh. um, we just bought this nice camera from Best Buy. I wanted to try it out. Okay. So yeah, he showed up in the house on time this morning. <laughs> And uh, so yeah, we shot all day. Did you guys have a concept, cool. a theme? Oh, um, yeah, he did, and uh, it evolved a bit. It's gonna be cool. I, think I gave so him nine days to him? finish it. So. Okay, really? Yeah. So like in the next done. few weeks, we're gonna see yeah, a new video. Yeah, I'm gonna put it up. Yeah. And what's the song? It's. Can I swear? I'm yeah, not. of course. It's called Fuck It. Fuck It. Yeah. Yeah. I like the theme because that's generally been my attitude lately. <laughs> it was the second song we played today. So. Okay. Yeah, that'll be up for download. And uh, they announced like the Hamtramck Fest, the DIY, all that stuff. Are you on any of that this year? Yeah, we're playing DIY. I'm not sure what day. Yeah. They, I don't think they've said the days yet. I, okay. Yeah, but definitely you can check out George Morris at DIY this year. Yeah, we're playing Dally in the Alley I would well. highly suggest them if you're going to make your little list of who you're going to go see. Yeah, so... Um, We're also doing, um, on the 29th, uh, Motor City Blogs. Um, oh, their party that they're having. Yeah, the internet yeah, happy saw hour. <laughs> like, early show at the State Bar. Okay. So, yeah. It's, okay. Yeah, well, thanks for up. talking to us, George. Um, where can they find you online? Uh, on Facebook, George Morris Music, or Bandcamp, George Morris Death. Okay, so I highly suggest you guys check out George Morris. I think you're going to see more of him. Um, thanks for watching. Hip in Detroit.